This next position, once again, is from the Delhi Hiva Pan Grip, but this time we have our leg, our right leg free, and we're going to learn how to enter the X guard position from when our opponent is holding our collar, pulling nice and tight, and putting, attempting to put pressure. So we're gonna check it out. So here we are in the Delhi Hiva position. My opponent is not over my leg yet, and he's holding the position really tight, and it's very, very difficult to enter this position, especially if I don't have any sort of elevation or kick. Of course, I can kick his leg, but his grip is in the way, I wouldn't be able to insert my leg into the position. So what am I gonna do here? I'm gonna keep my leg high and free, and I'm gonna bring my left leg onto his shoulder. Now, if he's really, really tight to me, I can even use my right hand here to push his shoulder away to get my left, left foot on his shoulder. Especially for the go guys who are a little bit less flexible, it can be difficult just to throw my leg inside. So when he's really, really tight, I need to use my right hand to push him away and get this left foot on his shoulder. Now from this position, it's gonna be very, very easy for me to use this kick, kicking motion here to break this grip. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna kick him away with my left leg and then my left foot right away is gonna go into the hip. Now if I didn't do this kick and he keeps this grip, it's gonna be very, very difficult for my foot to find this foot on the hip. It's nearly impossible, but if I do this kick, my foot is gonna go right to the hip. And now it's gonna be a very, very simple transition, or not too simple, but it's gonna be a simple transition into the X guard position. So the next step is gonna be this right foot is gonna hook right behind his kneecap here, right here. And we're gonna do a nice tripod sweep, and my opponent's gonna base on his hand and not, not wanna fall completely, because if he falls, he's kind of like a, a dumbo, right? This is a very simple sweep. And most people will not fall from this position, they'll come right back up. And as he's coming right back up, I'm gonna grab the collar, I'm gonna insert my knee inside, and pull him back up into the single leg X position, just like so. Just one more time. Again, my grip is very tight here. He's grabbing, he's putting pressure. I'm gonna bring my left foot on his shoulder, I kick him away, and my foot magically finds its place on the hip. And this right foot is gonna insert right behind his knee, as I do a nice little tripod sweep, uh, a lot of us call it the Dumbo sweep because only Dumbos get caught by this sweep. So we push and he falls. He's gonna come back right back up because he doesn't wanna give up the sweep points from here. So my left knee is gonna, ex or excuse me, my, right foot, my left foot is gonna extend him away as my left knee inserts inside. And I'm gonna use this collar grip to pull him back and once again lift him to the side to get an easy entry into the single leg X position. I'm nice and tight here. Okay, one last time. So I can't get the foot on the hip, it's very difficult. Extend away, foot goes to the hip. Now this little transition here from when my opponent has the collar and to get this foot on the hip is one of the one of the most powerful techniques that I've found as of late to uh, set up the X guard position. So really, use, you can use this in all, all different positions. If you can get this foot on the hip, there's so many different options you have, but definitely my preferred option is a single X guard option. All right, so check it out.